Panning in a viewport is easy enough to achieve between commands, but not so easy when you're in the middle of a command. Say you are using the line tool to trace over an image of a chess piece you have displayed in the top viewport. The idea is to create a profile that you eventually lathe. Of course, before you start the command, you can use zoom and pan to concentrate on an area of work. In this case, let's assume you decided to start at the foot of the bishop piece. And so using the line command, you start tracing a rough outline that you'll eventually fine tune. You get to a point where you're stuck, as you need to pan up to see the rest of the chess piece. At this moment, using the mouse wheel or the navigation icon to pan the view results in being kicked out of the line command. When you get to the point where you need to pan the view, the trick is to place the cursor in the direction you wish to pan and then press the I key. The view pans in that direction and you are still in your current command. You can repeat the procedure as many times as you need and in any direction you choose. Another bit of trivia here is that you can use the mouse wheel zoom tool to refocus on an area of work. By default, zooming in and out doesn't shift focus in a viewport and you end up zooming in and out the same focus point. But under Customize, Preferences, Viewports, you can enable the zoom about mouse point modes. With this mode enabled, the zoom in function now is based on the position of the cursor and you can shift focus easily to concentrate on an area that needs your attention. Like the eye pan method, zooming in and out using the mouse wheel is transparent and doesn't cancel the current command. 